Welcome to State of Tech. I'm going to show you how to customize the control center on your iPhone 10. So if we quickly jump into our settings, you'll notice about in the middle of the screen we have control center. Tap in there, we can allow access with inside of apps. And what access within apps means is that we can actually swipe down on the top right hand corner and access control center whenever we're inside an application. Whether that be our settings, our messages, Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, whatever app you have open, if you have access within apps enabled, you'll be able to swipe down and access control center with inside applications. And then the other option is to customize our controls. So tap in there and we have our basic controls that are already enabled by default up in the top of the screen. You see where it says include. And then we have more controls down at the bottom that I can quickly add just by tapping on the plus button. And I'll notice that they're actually gonna move up into the included section. And then what I can also do is actually drag them on the right hand side and put them in whatever order I want them to be in. So if I wanted my text size to be right below my wallet, just go ahead and do that. And then what we can do now is access our control center and notice that I actually have quite a few more controls that you saw earlier because I added those in here. And what's also nice is with control center, some of these options have 3D touch toggles. So for example, if I were to 3D touch on the camera icon, notice I can quickly jump in and take a selfie, record video, record slow-mo, even take a portrait. And then even with the flashlight, if I 3D touch on the flashlight, I have different stages of brightness that I can enable just by swiping up on the flashlight indicator right here. So I think it's really cool that you can come in here and customize your control center to show or hide any icons that you do or do not want just by coming in here into the settings. So now that we've actually had those added, if we want to remove them, just tap on the check mark, remove, and then do that for any icons that you no longer want inside of your control center. And so that is how you customize your control center on your iPhone 10. If you found this video useful, be sure and give it a thumbs up. And for more videos like this, be sure and subscribe to State of Tech, and we'll see you in the next one.